Hey everybody, this is Brooke. Today we are going to be reviewing the Food Saver FM2435 vacuum sealing system that came with the attachment serrate system. As you can see here at the top, we have three buttons. They are for the type of food selection, the seal button and the vacuum seal button, as well as a power indicator. This power indicator will not turn on until you have turned this knob to operate. As you can see, the power indicator came on and we can now select whether we are doing a dry food or a moist food. The knob on the right hand side does turn from operate to storage to open mode. On the left hand side, we do have the Ziploc vacuum system attachments. This would be really simple to install. You would just select this, put this in the accessory port, and then this piece would be put, placed onto the Ziploc bag to ha use the reusable bags. One of my favorite things about this product is that it is fairly simple to use. It even comes with a how-to sticker on the inside cover. The general principle is fairly simple. You measure out the bag length that you need. You use the heat strip right here to seal one end. You place your food on the inside and then you use the vacuum button to seal and suck the air out of the other side. One of the most important things I have learned since using this food saver is that when you are doing any product, it is best to have as flat a row as possible. You don't want things laying on top of each other. So regardless of whether you're doing a moist product like meats or a dry product like nuts, you want them to be as flat as possible so that no air gets stuck. The Food Saver has been extremely useful in saving my family from wasting meat and allowing us to buy in bulk and then store food for later use. And I would highly recommend this model for its ease of use and the accessory port, which allows you to have greater versatility.